Riley, guys. We're doing the same exact thing. I know it doesn't look like it because I've got my plate of pizza and then Kaki's got a plate full of pot roast and mashed potatoes, but um, this is for all, this is for both of us. Um, Kaki was originally going to do the Taco Bell kit crunch wraps or- um, No, I was doing the quesadillas again. Quesadillas again. And then we got a late start. And by the time my vodka sauce was starting to brew, and um, the oven was preheated for my cookie pie. Kaki's like, I'm just not doing this tonight. I said, I was like, it was too much. My mom made homemade pot roast, which she does not do a lot. It's stunk up the whole house to where that's all I've been thinking about all day. I'm like, why don't we just both do pot roast? I wouldn't potatoes. say it stunk up the house. It was a good smell. Yeah. Oh, I know. It I was a good smell. I've been looking forward to eating pot roast all, all day long, and I didn't even try it. Um, so I said, why don't we split my Detroit-style vodka pie ingredients by paisans, and then we'll also do a plate of pot roast and mashed potatoes. And she's like, okay. So we're going to do a homemade Taco Bell dish tomorrow. Hello, Vanessa. Hello, Abby. Hello, everybody oh, else hello, who said guys. hello to us. Vanessa, Abby, hello. Hello, everyone. Move you over so you're more on the camera. <sighs> hmm. Figured out last night when I made that pizza, too much garlic, it's a thing. Last night's pizza was too much garlic. Still good, but too much garlic. Drooling food looks delicious. Thank you very much. I'm telling you, I think I haven't tried it. But I can always tell by the way it looks. My vodka sauce is getting better each time I make it. Hello, Jamie Curley. Yeah, um, Jamie's vodka sauce. It's like, no joke. It's it was it's, it's freaking it's delicious. Just, oh my god. <laughs> I can tell by Every the way it looks. Every time he makes it, it's just it's so much better. So much better. Can you put some vegetables, vegetable meal fun in into me? Oh, I have broccoli, but I forgot about it. It's in a bag, and I'm, this is my vegetables. So, hello, Professor Splash. What's up, guys? I love your channel. Just discovered it about a week ago. Well, thank you for uh, introducing yourself. Uh, definitely th a thing called too much garlic. Yeah, it was overkill last night. It was still good. I ate the last slice of pizza. I thought it was good. It was very good. But when you bite into pizza and you taste garlic right away it's not a good sign so i decided not to go heavy on the the roasted garlic tonight what's up from wisconsin hello what's in the green juice it's vegetables khaki makes it for me it's a blend so you guys might hear crickets and that's because it's cold on long island so we shut the uh the oh, central it's air super off cold. air is off but here, there's, there's, there's a, there's more to the story. We got bees or wasps. Oh no, we, no, we have, attic. we have They're yellow. They're coming in the house. No, we have yellow jackets. Yellow jackets. Yellow jackets. Then they come in the damn house. Oh my god, I can't. All I keep thinking about is that stupid movie from like the mid nineties. I don't know if you guys seen it, but it was called The Bees, and it was about like the killer bees that were infiltrating like towns in parts of the u.s oh my god this is my life coming true <laughs> it's like my biggest fear it's my biggest fear imagine going to sleep and then all of a sudden yeah. being woken up by being stung in the ass <laughs> oh we have um we have uh we got a, they made a nest in the attic there's a whole ass nest in and the they're attic. coming through the smoke detectors but that's what your dad bought. That's they're what not, I said. They're not, though. Well, he taped they're them not, up. Though. He taped those suckers up, but they're still coming in. Uh, well, dude, your <clears> videos <throat> are epic. Thank you very much. Um, hello, g -Sir. What are y'all oh, eating? Oh, hello, Shirley. Detroit-style vodka pizza homemade by me. Uh, sauce is, is a mixture of my homemade and then paisans. The dough is also paisans. Uh, and then me and Kaki are also eating mashed potatoes and homemade pot roast that my mom made today. Whoosh, dude. Your videos are epic. Thank you. 
But anyway, yeah, so we got, remember that movie? Uh, it was a, two different movies. One was about tarantulas, and then the oh, other was God, about the, oh, snakes. I, no, a, I remember, phobia, I remember. Phobia or something? I remember arachnophobia about the freaking the spiders. Oh my God. I hate spiders. I'm deathly afraid of spiders. My, that freaking movie was also from the mid-90s. Terrified me. And then we're living like the whole bee thing. I'm like, oh, I can't. Have, I just can't do you it. You have vents in the house. Uh, vents in the house, yes. Yeah. All right. But you they're want to not try the pizza the first? Thank God. I'll let you pick first. Which one do you want? Uh, I'm going to try pizza first. I know that. I'm saying which one I'll let you pick first. First. Nice and easy. I'll go with this one. I'm not picky. How long did you put the tomatoes in the oven for? About a half an hour. Mm. Oh my god. It's good. It's really good. It's beyond really good. Yeah. It's freaking phenomenal. Ooh! Shit, man, I got a talent. Um, Mike, who cheese raw? Hello, Stu. Yeah, that's really good. Oh my god. Wow. You think it's missing anything? Or no? Maybe a little bit more garlic. Mm. For my taste. For my taste, I think it needs more garlic, but this is freaking delicious. Hello, Lisa. We don't talk politics, mm -hmm. nor do we really care. Figure out that that's like the polite way of uh, me saying uh, we don't talk about it. We don't do politics. Plus, a big reason is we really don't understand it. it, it too. We don't pay attention to it. People get mad when we say that. How can you just put your head in the sand and not pay attention to what is wrong in the world today? Um, Listen, we have our own shit that we have to deal with. Yeah. <laughs> we got our own shit that we have to deal with. I'm not worried about everybody else's political views. Grass can all, like, do whatever you need to do. But we have our own shit we have to deal with. How are those new shoes working out with the running? My first night with them, Vanessa, they were great. They're the <laughs> same exact <laughs> shoes that I had. They're just a half a size smaller, and I, I got them a lot quicker. I wasn't expecting them until Wednesday. Listen, they asked for, like, the order number, like, when Jamie was just like, oh, yeah, I ordered these shoes or whatever, blah, 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 and then I gave them the order number, and I'm, I'm looking at, like, when they're supposed to arrive. They weren't supposed to arrive until Wednesday, mm -hmm. and then I got a text today where I was like, your palubas are arriving. Yeah, I was she like, texted oh, me. wow. I'm like, that was freaking quick. And then that I, was really quick. I texted her. I'm like, my shoes have arrived. I know. I saw that. I'm going in for the pot roast. I'm going to see which, which dinner I like better. Oh. You got your own. Fork and knife. Well, all right, because apparently we don't share. Why? When I bought, I brought two sets to the table. And my mom's pot roast is freaking delicious. Your mom's pot roast is always good. I don't know how to make pot roast. I've, I've made pot roast before. I made it in the crock pot, and I've, it comes out freaking delicious. I've made it with like roast beef. Not the same thing. You've never made pot roast a day in your life. With roast beef, I have. Pot roast is a whole ass meal that gets cooked in the oven. I know, I never really made it. <laughs> Hello, Kelly. Did you make your dinner, your mom? My mom made the pot roast and the mashed potatoes, Abby. I made the pizza. My mom, my mom made so much of it. 
Um, I said, I'm going to have a little bit for dinner tonight with my pizza. And once it's, once her, her, once it was done, I got home, I took the kids go-karting tonight while Kaki uh, was taking a nap because of, she, she had to get up early for work. So I took the kids go-karting and when I got home, the pot roast was pretty much done and like just resting. And I'm like, holy crap, that smells delicious. I knew I was eating it. Hi, Pizza Rocks. Thanks very much. At this angle, it looks very good. At the <clears throat> I thought it was a big piece of salmon. <laughs> what, the pizza? Oh, no, I'm saying which one is better? I don't know. If I had to pick one to eat, I gotta take one more bite of my mom's pot roast. And I'll give you an honest answer. I think regardless of what I say, what you guys see me eating throughout the night, you'll be able to tell which one I like more because I'm eating more of that. Let's go. Been using orange gel all day. Paros is really good, but my pizza is delicious too. What's up, Jess? You pick two, Kaki. Which one do you like better? Pizza. Pizza? Me too. Well, I'm picking the pizza. Pizza is definitely better. Tomorrow's going to be tricky. I think I'm not going to be feeling better by Monday. What did I say? Monday or Tuesday? If my tooth isn't feeling better, I would go to the dentist. Tuesday? I think I said Tuesday. But, um, I think I'm just going to go to the dentist and get the shit pulled. It smells amazing. Thank you. Hello from Ireland. Hello, Gaiman Harrell. Um, yeah, I, um, Orgel doesn't seem to be working as well as it used to, so I think I'm going to want to... Is that the tooth that you have, like the, um, yeah. root canal? Yeah, we were talking about this last night. I think I'm just going to go and get it pulled. You need to get it pulled. Mm-hmm. I can't go Monday. But um, I might go Tuesday, take off Wednesday, because I'm going to be in pain. And uh, we'll see how everything plays out. I think... First I'm, of all, you need to make an appointment. I know. Then I have an x-ray, and then, like, oh, figure out, like, what's wrong with it. No, no, no need to x-ray it, just pull it. They have to x-ray it. Yeah. They might be able to save it. But. No, they won't. Because when I originally got this tooth fixed, she said, you just made it in time for us to save it. If any more of it were to like fall off or whatever it was, we wouldn't be able to save it. And um, I should have just said, I just, I should have just said pull it. But I didn't. Got it fixed, never got went back to get it like finally like 100% fixed and then like two years ago hmm. that's the tooth that you have like a roof now but you never finished the roof mm -hmm. now Jim Rollins do you like vodka sauce more than normal pizza sauce my vodka sauce is pretty damn good however I like a normal bar pie you know, back in my youth, Orogel was in a powder form. You added it to hot water and gargled it. It was way better. Did you still get it like that? I wonder if you can still get not. it like that. 
Listen, if you're having an issue, you need to go get pulled. I am. I think I'm going to. I'll make the appointment for you. They will x-ray it even if they are pulling it. Yeah, so they can charge you for it. You don't so, pay for insurance, so don't worry about it. Somebody's paying for it, and that's why they do it. They add on extra steps to get that money, honey. And They're how, not paying for it, so let them, let them x-ray yeah, it. I know how it works. That was your fourth. I know it was my fourth. We could share. It was your fault. <clears throat> Says the dime wrapper really toothpaste. No. He needs to go get his tooth looked at because he's had an issue with it now for a while. Yeah. For a while. But it always seems to go away. The outdoor sounds on your live remind me of old home back eats. Seattle sounds like traffic 24-7. We have all the windows open because it's kind of chilly on Long Island. So that's what you hear, and you hear those crickets. Really? You can go to a place and they can put you under? They can have you done in minutes. They did that with my mom. I don't like to be put under. Yes, you can be put under. I could have been put on for my tooth when the last time I had it pulled. Um, I don't like being put under. I don't want to do that. I've ne actually never been put under. I've never been put under in any type of like surgery. I was always awake. Yeah. Even when I had both of our kids, I was awake. C-section and all. Fully awake. D I don't think that I would want to be put under for anything. That scares me, being put under. What if I don't wake up? <laughs> well, you would never know. I guess not. You're right. I guess I wouldn't know. You're right on that. Wow, it's a scary thought. <laughs> it's a really scary thought. <laughs> no, thank you. No. I think I'll just get the shot. Novocaine me? Pull that sucker. Yeah. You gonna finish that, LOL? I don't know. Um, probably not, just because my tooth is bothering me. Um, which sucks. That means I probably won't finish tomorrow's dinner. I probably won't finish Monday's dinner. Tuesday, probably I won't even eat. Maybe soup if, if I actually go to the dentist. Mm, how long have I been telling you to get your tooth looked at? How long? A long time. I know. And you're like, I'll just do this problem. This is a problem. This problem. But you're probably going to pull a tooth. What? You're probably going to pull your tooth. I don't give two shits if they could say they could save it. I want it pulled. I don't want it there no more. I have plans. They're not going to put you under. They're just going to give you like friggin' Novocaine and a little happy gas. And then you're like, <laughs> here goes my tooth. It wasn't asking to be put under. I'm, I know. I'm just Albert telling you. Albert said that. I have this. I wish I had been put under because that, that shit was traumatic for me. <laughs> it was very traumatic. I wasn't prepared for it. You can eat. I have been eating. What are you talking about? I don't see you eating. Have another slice of pizza. Peggy's <sighs> tired still. And we I just have been a... eating. What do you want? I just finished eating a slice of pizza. Please stop. Love you do. Beat it, pal. Hello, Court. How you doing, my friend? Hey, Court. Hey, I tell him to get things checked, especially his teeth, yeah, Kelly. So they don't listen. No. They don't listen. And then I wait till there's like a big ass problem. They're like, oh my god, my tooth really hurts. 
and then there's a problem. Yeah, I, Albert, I don't, I don't know why. There was like something with his wife or something like that, right? <sighs> hey, Cortland, you know what? Me and Kaki were talking about you like an hour and a half ago. I, um... You like Twinkies, Cortland? <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. No, no, no. I want to see your response before I say what I say next. For a swim later and enjoy tomorrow off. Work's been nuts. Well, there you go, Quint. Jamie, please try Tile. Tr Jamie, please try Advil and Tylenol together. It really works for pain. Um, we don't have Advil. We just have acetaminophen and we have ibuprofen. Ibuprofen. We don't have that. You guys like pumpkin. I don't. I do like pumpkin. Oh, Cortland, come on, buddy. Answer me. Do you like Twinkies? I need to see what your response is going to be. <laughs> Jeez, Court texted me the cream filled boys of the cake. <laughs> the what? Court texted me privately and said the cream filled boys of the cake. Huh? <laughs> so. <laughs> I'm asking you because Kathy brought you up. I asked her a simple question during during the, the making of our of tonight's dinner. I said, Kathy, you like Twinkies, extra cream, and she just starts to start to laughing. Yeah, because my mind went immediately to the cutter. And I said, why? Why do you got to be? Why does your mind go there? Like I was simply asking That's you a question. Where my mind goes she goes, Courtney would answer. Would start laughing too. I said, I'm going to ask him tonight if he likes yeah. Twinkies. Extra Court cream. Would, Court would definitely 100% laugh. Do you like Twinkies? We are the gutter khaki. <laughs> I know we're the gutter. I know we're the gutter. Do you just need a confirmation that we are the gutter people? <laughs> Roll a fatty, everything will be fine. Yeah, maybe. Until it wears off. Thank you, Court, for confirming the fact that my mind is in the gutter and you are there with me. Thank you. <laughs> Jamie, you ever made fried chicken? We've never made fried like chicken. Chicken cutlets. Chicken cutlets, but like. Never like. It's funny you say that. I have a chicken sandwich idea that requires fried chicken. Long Island with the hands. Hello, Hello Roz. Jazz or Roz. Roz Jaco. Yeah, Mary Jane won't help. And me and Kathy both woke up with soft throats this morning. What's up, Damon? My coworker is sick too. And I just look at him and I was just like, Ugh. I'm like, you spread your sickness to me. And he, was, he just started laughing. He's like, no, I didn't. And I was like, yes, the fuck you did. How would you spread it to you? Because we touch all the same shit. We touch the freaking thing to clock in and out. We touch the handles on the doors of the break room. We touch all the same shit. What's his name? Damon? Alex. Oh, Alex. Uh, well, uh, is he I'm sick just, right now? Yeah, uh, he's sick right now. I wouldn't he's say we're sick. We just no, got sore he's throat. been sick. He started with a sore throat. He started with a sore throat, and that's how it started. I'm like, oh, fuck. I did wait for the sore throat court, but not because of that reason. <laughs> yeah, we didn't do nothing last night. <laughs> not because of that reason. 
There's a reason why I didn't wake up like that. <laughs> yeah, we're taking a break from after dinner activities. Kaki has her monthly, so there's there's no reason for my sore throat other than the fact that I'm sick. Yeah. So you can take your reasoning and right out the window, Court. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I'm not going to be able to eat no more. Not because I'm full either. My tooth is really bothering me. Shit. And this is why I say to Jamie all the time, let me make you a dentist appointment. Get that shit looked at. Yeah. And he's like, no, no I'm going to wait until it's a problem. Now it's a problem. This isn't the first time we've had this issue. And it's like... Um, a week and it went away. Right, I'll take one more bite for you guys. Ginger, clove, and oregano. Yeah, no, I've heard about that. That'll Ginger, work. clove, That'll and work. oregano. That'll be more. Don't work. I'm gonna mouthwash after I'm done eating, and then do and some. And he's sticking to it. Yeah. Well, no, he's. Listen, I'm gonna make him a dental appointment, and he's gonna suck it up, Buttercup, and just go. I'm gonna go. I don't have a choice. You're going. I do have a choice. Oh, you're going. Because I'm not sitting here listening to you complaining about tooth. I'm not complaining. I'm saying my tooth is hurting me. And I'm not gonna eat no more. How am I complaining? Why is he get the fuck out of here? Infection went to my friend's heart and it killed him. So go. We're, I'm gonna go, Bezzy. He's going, don't you worry. I He's just going. don't know what day. Work sucks right now. So, um, I'll probably tell my boss tomorrow. He won't reply back to me. So, you know what you need to I'll do? I'll see his ass on Monday and I'll tell him. What's up, cooking Either I'm nation? here with my tooth problem, or I'm going to be <laughs> somewhere else getting my tooth fixed. Well. Keki, I've listened to my husband the past months, and that was over it for now. He has a dental appointment. Yeah, and that's why I'm telling Jamie right now. I'm not listening to him. I'm gonna, just going to make him a dentist appointment. Whether he likes it or not, he's going he's gonna to go. He has to go. I'm all for it. Because he I'm needs to have his tooth fixed. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not fighting him. But let me wrap this up before I keep on eating. And I I'll send the Twinkies to make you feel better. I haven't had a Twinkie in a long time. I don't think that's right. Thank you, Metalhead. All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for hanging out with us. Have Thank you for night, being guys. patient with us. Um, yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. Taco Bell, homemade Taco Bell tomorrow is the plans. So we'll see if we stick to yeah, it. Homemade Taco Bell. Good well, that's night. not my plans. <laughs>